السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ فرینڈس ویلکم بیک ٹو مائی چینل ٹوڈے وی ول ڈسکس فریکوینسی واٹ از فریکوینسی وین وی سی اینی سرکٹ فار پروسیسرس فار سوئچ ماڈ پاور سپلائز فار اینی الیکٹرانک سرکٹ ڈیجیٹل سرکٹ وی سی اٹ از ورکنگ ایٹ ففٹی کلو ہرٹس it is working at 4 megahertz it is working at 100 kilohertz what is that when we say our appliances in the home washing machine tv fridge other all items are working at 50 hertz 60 hertz what is that let's see the example and then we will continue basically it is a question from one of my viewer question from homer suleiman he asked me what is the frequency you can see i have a complete list of your comments your requirements i am sorry for being late frequency name of repetition a one event that will occur with a specific time that will repeat its repetition it is called frequency frequent it will come again and again with a specific time so in frequency we can say the time is basic element so that this event will occur at the same time interval what is that i am using this permanent magnet dc motor it is used in dvds and cd players i am using as a generator to demonstrate because this time i am i don't have generator so we will use this motor as a generator to generate some signal some voltage i will mark this rotor position and we will mark this physical position basically this motor or this generator it have a permanent magnet set here inside that will make north and south when we move any conductor in the magnetic field it will generate voltage when we will move the rotor or conductor in the magnetic field either it is permanent magnet or it is electromagnet so it will generate voltage the rotor position from this point when it will start rotation when it will start rotation and it will reach back again to the same point after completing 360 degree or a full complete cycle circle it is called one cycle when it will repeat again and it will reach, reach again so we will say it is one cycle one cycle one cycle so it is repeating its movement it is repeating its movement like this it is called one cycle if it will complete one cycle in one second it is it will called one cycle per second one cps one cycle per second what is that it will complete its rotation in one second so it is one cycle per one second in new terminology it is called one hertz one cycle per second or one hertz it is one unit this is output wave shape of this generator here we have output it is a rotor it will rotate and its position in the magnetic field will determine the peak high peak low peak actually it is rotation degree of the rotor we say positive peak we say negative peak so this peak is the translated value of mechanical shaft position of this rotor inside the magnetic field when it is moving when it is static it will not generate any voltage let's check it when it is static it is not generating any voltage when i will move it when i will move it move it with speed it will make more pulses so the rotor is spinning many times in one second I, if i will spin it slowly 
we can see the time difference between these pulses and these pulses. If we divide it, this time in seconds, if I say, I have one second here. Now, it was one cycle. One cycle. Now, I am specifying here one second. And if we measure how many times it will repeat its this position. What is that? It is starting from this point. How many times it will repeat its this position? The rising edge from 0 to positive side. It is positive value. It is negative value. We can say 1. Until here it is 1 cycle. Because it is 0 degree. When it is coming back from positive peak, it is called 180 degree. 2, 3. In 1 second, we started from here. 1, it is a complete rotation. From this point to this point, complete rotation. 3 rotations. So we completed 1, 2, 3. One cycle, two cycles, three cycles. We completed one, two, three cycles. In one second, it is called time. Time one second. And how much time it will take to complete one cycle, it is called time period. So we have three cycles in one second if our wave shape is completing one cycle in one second so its time period will one second but if we have a repetition three cycles in one second each cycle will take one of number of cycles one over three is equal to point three 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 second for one pulse if we will increase the frequency if we will increase the repetition so this time period will decrease automatically because it is inversely proportional and frequency is equal to 1 over time period how much time is allocated for one cycle here we allocated 0.33 second so 1 over 0 0.333 second 1 divided by 0.333 so our frequency is 3 hertz so we are repeating 3 cycles in 1 second if we say we have 60 hertz frequency that means our generator is rotating at 60 rpm we have a power generator generator anything which is generating the electrical power so that means its rotor will spin 60 times per second. 60 times. If we say 50 hertz, it means how many times it will rotate in one second. If we say 100 kilohertz, kilo that means 1000. So it means it is rotating 100,000 times per second. So these frequencies in kilohertz in mechanical movement for gyros and for high speed spinning devices that is possible. But in routine power devices it is impossible to generate too much high frequency. For that purpose electronic generators are used. So now it is clear that frequency is repetition of any event within one second are given time that is one second it is a standard how much repetitions will repeat in one second it is called frequency i hope so this video is informative if it is informative hit the like button if you have any question please let me know in the comment box thanks for watching assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh